Hello, I'm Martin Fenske and welcome to another part of Let's Play Battle Brothers. If you watched the previous part, you know what our plan for today is. We want to get to Karkovl and we are looking for some quests from House Rosenwing. But before we start playing, there are some changes that I have to make. Uh, first, uh, actually, let's start here with the quest in Zomerstadt. Uh, they are sending us to Forgotten Musgrave, and I decided to ignore this quest. It really sounds to me like a location with skeletons, and I don't want to risk running into ancient legionnaires, possibly ancient other guards. It's just not worth it. 2000 may sound like a decent reward, but when you compare it to rewards from the war quests, it's not that much. War quests usually uh, are paid better than this, plus all the gear that we get uh, from those quests most of the items are just T1 weapons and one of those weapons sells for a couple hundred crowns which means those are easily four to five thousand crowns quest each of those so yeah 2000 is really not that much right now maybe if this was uh, a quest from the house Rosenwing then I'd think about it but just for a city don't care uh, that's one thing just explaining why I'm ignoring this quest then another thing is Grimald. Grimald will be leaving the company. I'll just uh, make sure that he leaves all the items I care about behind. Uh, he has or he has bleeder insecure, so that's two negative uh, traits. Uh, but I've removed the shield. I checked this before I started recording. He has uh, double grip, but even with that, it's only seventy-three melee skill on level eleven. That's just not enough. Uh, which means, yeah, we'll be dismissing him. Uh, right now we have 16 brothers, that's too many. Maximum I'm willing to have is 15. So, let's get rid of Grimald. Uh, we'll pay the compensation. If we don't do that, uh, the morale or mood of everyone would uh, decrease. So I want to prevent that. 900 is not that much. I expected more. I expected around like 2000. So this is perfectly fine. And what it's doing. So now we are back to 15 and he even left all the gear behind. I wasn't sure that he leaves the gear behind so I wanted to uh, make sure we have the important items. Now uh, Olaf will take his place at least for easier fights until he gets uh, to a higher level. On level 1 we can't really have him facing some tough opponents. But he can at least get some upgrades. That's one, two, he can get the net and uh, the bandages. Okay, also another change. Olaf is not Olaf anymore, but from now on it will be called Kronar. Welcome to the company. That's another change and there was one more thing. Uh, Ulf. Ulf is not Ulf anymore. From now on. And I hope that I don't mess up the name now. Uh, Shadecroft the Barber. Shadecroft the Barber. Also welcome to the company. Uh, Shade didn't have a specific request for a role so I decided uh, to go with uh, our Hammerman. Uh, he'll be definitely staying in the company with these numbers. And uh, Dexterous isn't bad. Greedy, well, I know about that. I'm willing to pay, so that's not a problem. On level 9, already 94 melee skill. So there is a high chance that on level 11, this will be over 100. 29 melee skill. So, really, really good numbers. I hope that I that the choice is not something you specifically don't want. But well, that's the changes. So everyone who is new, welcome to the company. And we can start playing. I'm just checking if I didn't want to do something else. No, I don't think so. Let's head for Kalkovel. And hopefully we get the a decent quest there. The important thing is that it's from House Rosenwing. We need to rebuild the reputation. That was a huge mistake that I misclicked in that one uh, dialogue. But now it's 
too late to do anything about it. All we can do is start working on the reputation again. There is a contract. Three skulls. Well, three skulls looks like a, a war contract. Well, let's check what it is. 2100, 2300. Sounds good. And it's. No, it's orcs. Kill more than greenskins around Zomerstadt. Hmm. And the three skulls. This looks like a pretty dangerous quest. But on the other hand, it's Zomerstadt. It's very close. So. With a bit of luck, you might be done with this one in less than a day. And uh, try to find another quest. Uh, risky, but a very fast way how to rebuild the reputation. I think we don't have a choice. And we already killed some quite strong groups of uh, Oryx. Yeah, let's go for it. Um, can we buy some tools and supplies? We can. I think just one stack for now is enough because the quest is so close. I think we are fine. Oh, what is not fine is the group composition. For a fight like this we need to replace Kronar. Maybe what I'm gonna do now and look in the group on the party, I'm going to move Gisbert. So we have one, two, three heavies on this side, one, two, three heavies on this side. Yep. Okay, let's go to Zomerstand then, and I hope we don't run into some insane group full of orc warriors and orc berserkers. I don't think that we can get orc warlord when it's outside of an outpost or a camp. Okay. But still a large group of uh, orc... That's it. What is it? <laughs> berserkers, warriors and warlord. I had no idea it's possible to get a warlord outside of an outpost. And I have very little experience in fighting warlords. 11. So this means 7 to 8 warriors. Hopefully we can take out the berserkers before they can get to us. This looks like fun. Uh, we have Alaric, we have Peritwin. Uh, the warlord he has very annoying like war cry that reduces uh, everyone's morale. Similar to guys, just not that strong, but still annoying. Well, let's do it. Um, oh, hey, do we have help from a caravan? Some cannon fodder? Take out this one bear circuit before he gets cover. He's running already. But I still try to kill him. 67, come on. Kill him! There we go. one thing I want to do. I want to move the front line forward. Because what we learned in the previous fight against Oryx is that they like to use the breakthrough ability or how it's called that they push someone back and like that open the, the line and get to our archers and by moving one tile forward it'll be harder for them to reach the archers. They'll still be able to get like through the line but not all the way to archers will give us some time to always retreat. Just can't afford to move too close. I don't want to give them the height advantage. Um, wait. Let's get ready with the spear wall. I'm not sure if they can get to us or not. Not 
yet. So good thing is that they can't flank us here. Or they can, but uh, it's not easy. They can't go through these obstacles. Oh. Interesting. Hmm. Seems that the caravan hands are trying to help even. Was that is this the, the warlord? No, that's person. Where's the warlord? Oh, here is the warlord, right? Yeah, uh, Horgash Ghoul. Hmm, let's try to take out the Berserkers first. I want to kill them because that crime not only lowers our resolve, it improves their resolve, so one war cry and he's back in the fight. Wait for it. Maybe think about moving forward. Let's do it. Let's just be a bit more aggressive, at least one, on one side. Try to take this one out as well. Can't really do that much here. Okay, Apostolis, you can move up. That was a mistake. I should have moved down. Uh, one of them will get onto this tile and they will cause trouble. Uh, stupid mistake. Ow. This might be actually good for us. We can focus on the warlord first. I know, Ari. Can you handle an orc warrior alone without any help? Uh, you will be fine. Okay. Shade. Will be really important for this. Um, hmm. Do we want to fight him when he has the height advantage? I don't think so. Sobo can move down and help here a bit. Wow, someone wants to be a hero. I'm not gonna complain, it definitely helps. Damn it. Okay, please don't miss. Good. Helmet is gone. I think Alric will wait. I have a feeling that uh, uh, the warlord may use that war cry now. Mm 
Mm, let's try to stack up some more overwhelm. Apostolis. Okay, let's move on to this. I want to lock this Orc Warrior in place. Oh, he's running. Wow, that's unexpected. That's quite annoying. The biggest problem is that we or that we that shade can't reach the warlord anymore. I was moving our spearman forward was that uh, I wanted to make sure that Gisbert can move on the same level as the orc, but he panicked surprisingly. We don't have to worry about him anymore. <laughs> I suddenly don't know what to attack. Can't attack anything now. Let's wait. Here we can try on the warlord. I guess Bert can move up. Might be a mistake. I should have moved towards this one. Yeah. Okay, that was a nice hit. Who's next? Oracle, wait. What's the best attack that we have here? Probably this one. And please kill him. Now! Looks like it. Ah, damn it. We don't have enough action points for another swing. Uh, never mind. Let's try this one. They're slowly getting to our archers. Don't have to retreat yet, but soon. Kill him. Let's play it safe and start retreating already. We still may need help up here, so let's move the air. Oh, that was a nice attack. That was a headshot. Thank <laughs> you. 
That was a lot of damage we did on this turn, but they're still not dying. 95, 89. Well, let's try this one. At least he has the cuts in you that uh, quite significantly reduces melee skill, I think. Still hit. Okay. And there is the war cry. Bad timing. Okay, can we save Shade? This one. Well, all our archers have a line of fire on them, so there's a good chance that we kill him. Decided to run, I don't have to help him. Try to catch him, probably. It's still, quite a lot of experience we can get for killing our warrior. Can you reach him? Nope. But moving two tiles down. One tile. There we go. Hmm, what about level ups? Alrake and Gisbert. And what about loot? Tools and supplies, some ammo, pretty much all the weapons, some shields. Well, I don't really care about the loot. All I care about is that everyone survived. When I saw the composition, I wasn't quite sure we can handle that. Also, the caravan helped a lot. We can repair everything. Or repair it as much as possible before we get back to Kalkovo. Now, the level ups. Uh, Gisbert is a swordsman. Um, don't have Battle Forged yet. So let's start there. Melee skill. Fatigue. Melee defense. The usual stuff, just the fatigue. We need higher numbers. Already level 8 and only 111 fatigue. That is so bad. And Alric. That's a good question. Oh, we don't have footwork yet. Okay, in that case, it's easy. Range skill, that's for sure. Fatigue. And only plus two resolve. 
Uh, I think I'll take initiative instead. We should get uh, more than plus two resolve. Already fifty eight. Yeah, I think I'll do it this way. It's risky not investing in the resolve every time, but plus two resolve sounds like a waste to me, even when it's a sergeant. Yeah, let's do it. Now, who needs some time for repairs? Einar, I'd say. How long does it take? One to three days and... Same here. Yeah, those are some really serious injuries. Okay, go, 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 go. Zomerstadt no longer has marauding green skins. And go, no longer has any quests. Anything new? Buy tools and supplies. Let's sell everything. I'm not gonna wait anymore. What is this? Oh, messenger. We have another wild man, but this one is for 500. We already have everything we want. Problem is we can't take multiple level one brothers, even with the good stats. One is like maximum. So for now, you won't be recruiting. And just wait. When everyone gets to like level seven to nine then maybe we look for another brother with exceptional traits and stats what about shops do you have anything no, nothing here and oh hey you do have something uh, too bad we have only eleven thousand. i'd like to buy the coat of plates but uh, they have Master Forge Dark Omen. Minus 1121. So that's similar to, let's say, this one. It's 13014. So minus 3 fatigue. And 9 point difference. But also 4500 difference in the price. But definitely not worth it buying. We find this, sure. Decent armor for our archers, that's for sure, but this is so not worth it buying. Well, we need to look somewhere else for quests. Closest city is Heimstadt. Let's try that. Well, they have quest, but not the quest that we are looking for. What is this? It's some caravan escorting the other side of the map, like to the east. Then I'd probably take it. I have important delivery heading out to Kalkovo. Eh. That's caravan escort. What's the other one? Five hundred and sixty for one skull quest. Five hundred eighty. Obtain stuff of golden harvest at Forgotten Mass Grave. 
Isn't this the same place where they're sending us in the... And how is it called? Uh, Zomerstadt? And wasn't it three skulls in Zomerstadt? We know about the location. Isn't it here? No, that's ancient burial site. This is ancient battle site. Odd. What we could try is just go to the other side, go to Dulkovod, Birkel, and try to find some quests here. Or we just accept the quest for the caravan escort to Kalkhovel, go Zomberstadt, Bitterland, Grunberg. Or maybe even Kalkhovel, Grunberg. You can go through the wilderness, try to find some locations along the way. What does it look like to the south? Uh, nothing new. Or another option would be to just ignore the contracts, go south and just kill random groups uh, that belong to the house, I don't know how they are called, to the house uh, Rumold, because we are at war with them. We can attack their caravans, we can attack anything that belongs to them. That will be at least a way how to get some extra items. Now, we have to rebuild the reputation. How does it look like? Open. Um, wasn't it neutral up until now? I think now we might be able to get the war quest again. I don't think they would give it to us as long as the reputation is neutral. But once it's open... They may trust us enough to give us those quests. Yeah, let's find out in the next part. We'll most likely head to Grunberg. Hopefully they have something here and if not then we would have to go towards Dunkelwald. I didn't expect to have such problems finding quests during the war. So that no matter where we go they will be offering us some contracts. But well, we'll just try to find something in the next part for today we are done. So I hope that you like this part, that you're gonna join me for the next one again. And until then, have a good time. Bye bye.